Hi guys, I just wanted to come on quickly, sort of, today and um, share with you sheet mask empties. Um, I'm sure everybody's familiar with a sheet mask. Um, I have a pretty strong addiction to them. Um, that's what one of them looks like. So I'm just going to go over them, um, the different brands and like what they're supposed to do and then... Um, tell you guys like how, how I use mine. So the first one that I have is from Dermal and it's a herb collagen essence mask. So this one is good for soothing and moisturizing. So this is a good like, um, like one that you could really use every single night and you do notice a difference in um, your skin feeling moisturized the next day, definitely. Um, another one is by Oh my gosh, I don't know. Um, but it's papaya. Papaya, and then it says with Iceland glacial water. So this one is for peeling, which, I mean, I don't really think for peeling. It just felt very nice and cooling on the skin. I put my sheet masks on um, when I'm getting ready for bed after I've showered and like cleansed my face. Um, I don't put a toner on before I'm going to use a sheet mask. I try to sheet mask out of the seven days a week. I try to do it four or five um, nights a week, which might seem a little excessive, but I try to, at least for May, I'm going to try to um, use more moisturizing ones and then use ones that like target a specific area two or three times a week. So if that makes any sense to people. Um, another one from Dermal is a gold collagen mask, and this one is for brightening and moisturizing. So again, I feel pretty safe, like, using this one daily, nightly, I should say. I always use them at night. Sometimes on the weekend, I'll put one on if I'm not really doing anything. Um, I think you pronounce this Epiel. This is a brightening mask with vitamin C. It contains vitamin C and botanical extracts, and it's good for brightening, rejuvenating, and conditioning. This one was really nice as well. It had a nice fragrance to it, fit my face very well. Um, what I do want to say about sheet masks is if you're using one for, like, let's say firming, um, when you first put that sheet mask on and you allow it to be on your skin for the 10 to 20 minutes that it requires, the next day, yeah, you might notice a little difference, but it's something that you have to be consistent with. So if you're using one for um, firming, use, a sh use that type of sheet mask two or three times a week and you will notice a difference. It's just like any other skin product that you put on your face. You don't notice something. You know, the first time you use a moisturizer, the first time you use an anti-aging cream or whatever, um, you don't notice something right away. You know, it takes time. You have to be consistent with the products. Um, this next one is from Oka, I believe, and this is a poor care one. This one was nice. I put these on, like I said, I clean my face, get ready for bed. I put these on like while I'm laying down in bed. Some of these you can like walk around. You can also get a um, like a reusable mask that has like kind of clips that goes around your ears so that that mask will stay on. It's like a silicone mask that you can put on if you need to do, you know, if you're doing like washing your dishes or vacuuming or whatever at night and you want it to stay on and not slide, you can buy one of those. They're super cheap. I got one on Amazon. I'll bring it the next time I do an empties of skin of sheet masks. I will um, show you what that looks like. But, and then I just like lay down and watch TV and I leave it on my skin for 20 minutes usually take it off. I pat that excess essence into my skin and that's it. I go to sleep. Um, with some of these, they're in the packets. Um, I'll just use this one as an example. This one is snail and this one is good for, um, regeneration, moisturizing and nutrition. Um, so when I take the, the sheet mask out, if there feels like there's a lot of extra essence in here, I pour that out into my hands and I put that on my skin, down my neck, 
before I even put the sheet mask on. That way you get, you know, like all the goodness that is in the sheet mask. I seem to be on a kick with the dermal. This was a pearl collagen mask, and this is for moisturizing and brightening. Again, I love how these ones fit on my face, and they're also like super easy to open. Um, the mask, actually, you know, once you have the mask out in your hand and you're opening up the layers because it's folded pretty small, um, it's very easy to open without tearing it or whatever, and it's thin. Um, okay, another dermal is the Acai, ber Acai Berry, and this is for health firming, and it's considered mild. I've never had a bad reaction from a sheet mask. They've never burned my skin. Um, so that's that. This is a 24 karat gold with Yucha. I think that's what it says. Vitamin C. So it says perfect skin, um, white gold glow mask, whitening function. This was really nice too. I love the packaging on this. And this had a ton of extra essence to the point that like I put it on my legs, my arms, um, pretty much everywhere. Another one from Dermal is a gold one, and this says it's good for brightening, moisturizing, and that's what that looks like. This one's super cute from the Creme Shop. It's a drink up skin, and it actually is that like penguin um, look. You know, when you put the sheet mask on, it really does look like a penguin mask. So this was super cute. Um, kind of small though, so um, that was okay. Excuse the background. My kids are, are yelling at each other. Um, trying to take two minutes to do something. Another one from Dermal is the honey grapefruit. And this is good for brightening vitality. Um, good one. Um, this one, it looks like I ripped the, the brand, but it's a green tree. Green tea, hyaluronic um, mask. And this one smelled really, really good. It reminded me of a hand lotion, but that one was super nice too. Um, one, a retinol. These were under eye pads. These were okay from Global Beauty Care. I think I got a bunch of these. They worked for like depuffing and stuff in the morning. Um, I'm not sure of the brand of this. It looks like it kind of. I don't know what I did to this one, but I kind of destroyed it. But the packaging's super cute. This was a um, coconut milk sheet mask. Looks like a carton of milk, and that's a moisturizing mask. I enjoyed that. Um, one from Etude House is a pearl, and that was for bright complexion. That was a great one. One I did not like. This one is from Ulta. And it's a smart skincare solution, skin energizing, bubbling sheet mask, revitalizing oxygen. It fit really funny. And I just, I don't know. I, it, I just didn't, I didn't like it. Another from Dermal. This must have, April must have been my month for um, Dermal. Um, this is an apricot and it's moisturizing, firming and brightening. So that one was good. Another dermal is a red ginseng, and this one was for firming and refining. Again, I really do like the dermal, and there you can get them cheap on um, Amazon. And then this one was a Medi Heal, and it was a RNA whitening sheet mask, and that was great. So that is everything that I have. My kids are fighting, so. I am going to go. Um, if you have any questions about sheet masks, please leave them down below and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks. Bye-bye.